good afternoon welcome to a new day by Martha this evening is another video of fun video it's not a video of religious so here I am making fun videos these past few days I'm enjoying it I'm having fun with it and the reason why I'm dressed like this because I have a few things to tell you and I want to just jump right in and tell you what the video is about it's about African culture and I'm not very good at talking about their culture but I'm going to tell you a little bit about what I like about them and what I enjoy about Africa. So being a Haitian, whenever I go out to the stores I always get the Africans exit me, exit me if I'm African. But one thing for sure they never start speaking their dialect to me which is good but I have a friend also sometimes she went, once she went with me and we went somewhere and Started speaking to her in Creole, and a lot of Haitian people tend to do that. If they meet an African, they start talking to them in Creole, they don't even know, you know, they do that so often. But the African, they don't do that, they speak to you in English. I don't know if because they speak English and they know that English is the language that's most spoken here in America. But the Haitians, they go right ahead and say, and, and start saying, Come on, yeah. oh, so melty feet. They always they did that to her. Like she doesn't say anything she doesn't know then she will have to, I will she will have to say no I'm not Haitian I'm not from Haiti so um, but for me I get some, some of the Ghanaian they always ask me if I'm from Ghana and some of the Nigerian they ask me if I'm from there too but this is a beautiful gift for my friend she's from, um, she's from Nigeria she gave me this beautiful dress be so happy because we are all from Africa all of us are from Africa especially the blacks we're from Africa and and also also um, if they don't if they ask you if you're from Haiti don't get upset because culture is a beautiful thing like I said God is so wise his, his wisdom is just beyond our comprehension that he sent all of us in a different little area to to live and then and this America that it, it, it blends us it has so much diversity you find African you find Indian you find you find uh, Asians you find all these different culture Hispanic and then when you blend them together it's so beautiful I don't know if you ever try different restaurants you don't have to always go to your own culture you don't have to always say I'm gonna eat at a Haitian restaurant I'm gonna eat at an African res restaurant I'm not gonna eat in a, 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 a Spanish restaurant I'm not gonna eat in this place but you gotta try everything even if you don't like it try it because you never know you might find that you like it you know and also talking about that you know don't be afraid like if you are if you are a woman who's not who's not um, married yet and you're praying to God and you're asking God to give you a mate you don't have to pray for God to give you a mate that is from your own culture you can find someone from another culture and you guys will blend very well will match very well so that's one thing I wanted you to know and also also don't forget you can wear these outfits. It doesn't necessarily mean that you're African because you're wearing an African gown. And if you are African, don't be ashamed. Don't be ashamed to wear your beautiful outfits because they are very nice because they are part of you. They are part of your culture. Um, 
I don't I don't know if I can find any Haitian outfits to, to do a video on but I really love this one she gave it to me and I haven't got the chance to wear it but I thought maybe I would show it to you so how let's talk about the African movies you know the African movies are so lovely if you are if you're bored you don't have nothing to do you can always watch an African African movies you can go to the African store they have Africans African uh, movies they're not too expensive you know the actors they are not in big Hollywood making big movies so so you can always um, buy a movie that you can support them by buying a movie and you can always go to YouTube and watch their movies because they have it all for free I remember when I was much younger now I kind of not I don't have the time I maybe I'm just not into watching TVs anymore but when I used to uh, watch the African movies I used to have all my siblings sitting there they can contest to that they can tell you this woman used to love 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 African movie I used to spend hours hours sometimes it would be one two three o'clock in the morning I'd be watching African movies non-stop and they know all the movies they will know all the storylines some of them used to make me cry because they have good storyline they are always nice I haven't found a movie African movie that I can say that was bad all of them were always nice and I love their 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 accent I love their their dialect I just love them and also you know, let's talk about the food. They love the jollof, jollof rice. I don't know if I said that word correctly, but they love that rice and and they, it's really good. It's really good. And so, and you know, there are also Haitian movies that we could always also support. Some of us tend not to support those actors. Like I remember when my uh, it was in the 2000, you know, the year of 2000, um, 2003 or 4 there was a lot of the business of um, Haitian movies were so big there were so many nice movies coming out but we tend not to support each other so now it died down we don't have these nice movies anymore we just have our phones we always on our phone we don't sit around and watch movies and talk to our families while we're watching the movies and making laugh you know doing jokes and all of that we don't but like I said, you have to support your, you have to love your culture and you have to appreciate other people's culture. Don't stick to your own and say that this is the only one I know. I have to stick by it. I don't need to, I don't, I don't need to explore. I don't need to learn about other people's culture. You have to. And that, like I said, I don't remember if I said it before. One thing I like about America it is diver it's the diversity we have everyone we have everyone one of my best friend my, my my closest friend friend is from india he's from sorry he's from guyana and he's indian and he is the nicest person you could ever meet so listen go out into the world go outside don't stay inside your house and say, I'm going to stick to my own kind. When you go out, when you go in, um, to school, talk to other people from other culture. When you go to church, talk to other people from other culture. You don't have to stick to your own kind, go into your own church. The um, people that from your own kind, that you only go there. You're not going to learn much if you just want to stay to your own kind. You have to open, open your horizon open it up and you know just go out there and find find all the other other places you know some of their spices and herbs are probably a little bit different maybe they cook with a lot of spices just be prepared to taste something different and you might like it well this is a quick videos it's just a fun video hopefully you 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 know you just enjoyed it and had a good life laugh if if um if um oh if you if you also like African African movies if you also um they have also nice music one, the, one another thing they love God they love God they truly love God if you find a good Nigerian Christian woman or men oh my God. They are prayer warriors. They love to pray. I am so 
you know I, I i i am so inspired by them whenever i i listen to to their music they do it from the heart you know they do it with their spirit and their mind you know and you have to um worship in spirit and truth so that's something that i really love about them that they really love god and god is always the center of everything and so and when you watch the movies, you also find about the Bushmen and all the voodoo and all those juju, whatever that stuff is. You know, you find out that too. But they are always praying people and the worship, worship song are beautiful. So that's a little bit what I have to say about Africa. I love African people. I love African music. I just love them because they are always very sweet okay hope that you have a wonderful wonderful afternoon and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and it's your friend Magda and it's a pleasure to be with you and always visit from time to time I'll be sure to make more videos and just let's enjoy the moment together take care God bless you it's a pleasure